I think so. Chance to gain uh, 20 ward on kill. Hungering Souls. Oh, sorry, I forgot Hungering Souls had a plus one. Eh, that's okay. Hmm. Shoot. Wait a second. Because this has a ton of forging potential. I know I just dumped some stuff into this, but I want to see... It's only plus one. I got plus three from the marrow shard. Uh, darn it. Okay, well that didn't go the way I wanted. How about we get a different offhand? Sorry, I know this is boring. Um, yes. Again, we'll wait till the end of the stream. <laughs> I need to not mess with it right now. I'm glad to get a chance to rest a moment. I don't know it's why you sound. It's been quite a this. day, you know. Yes. I see. I did not do the math right. So this has only been streaming for two hours and 15 minutes, but I only have 30 minutes left. That's only two hours and 45 minutes. Shoot. Okay. So I should have started an hour earlier. I still need to return to that. Maybe once we kill uh, this mini boss here. could change my belt. The only thing about my belt though is when I use a potion I get 200% um, damage increased to necrotic damage. It's an epic belt. Oh, 80% necrotic damage if you have been hit recently. No. What was it? Oh, there's the book. No. I thought someone was saying something about increased. Oh, if I've been hit recently, maybe that's what I'm thinking of. This is 80% increase. I thought it was something about 200%. I think I'm mixing my game up. Bonds right By the time you kill these mobs, normally he spawns. Holy cow, that almost killed me. 
Yeah, I'm definitely not gonna do the hungering souls thing. Uh, with uh, the aura of decay, because it would it requires me to be too close. It's just not worth it. Feel my wrath. Dude, would you appear already? He's being really stubborn. Do they decrease his, like, chance to spawn or something? Oh, that's what I currently have. Never mind. I was like, wait a minute, that looks, that looks pretty good. Alright. Alright, I'm about to turn that off. See that this gives you some rune slots, idle slots. You killed him. Oh, nope. thank you. Another damn passive point. <laughs> uh, let's do some spell leech. Do that. And then we'll go back to this other quest. Bring you in. I think this was the mission that's technically uh, optional, because you get you get more quests for idle slots than you need, and this is one of them you can be like, eh, and skip, and you still get all your idle slots. Because yeah, it's idle expansion, but I don't think this one's required. Nice when all the ward kicks in.
Now see, fighting the the voidlings are really nice because they generally fight in mass. Which is really beneficial for this build. Oh, they put the boss over here. The boss used to be like right over here. <laughs> They created a whole different area for him. Feel my wrath. Look at that, 15 plus stacks, that's hilarious. Oops, I turned it off and everything. A question mark. That's okay, I can portal back. I'm not sure what the question mark was. Well, this is a whole thing. Oh, this is a different timeline. Oh, okay. Can I just go back in? No, okay, it did change timelines. Hold on. I want to see what the question mark was. Fight him again. Fine. I think I can even face him. Not quite. Yeah, this highlighted and I didn't pick it up. Chance to cast Poison Nova when it hit. Oh, okay. Is that better than the one I got? No. Oops. This must be what you or someone was talking about uh, last time I was sharing. Temporal Sanctum. Each attempt of the dungeon card to keep dying or leaving through the portal. Where do you get a key? Get a key later on. Okay, 
interesting. That is also new to me. By the way, um, don't have a basement that is not well ventilated, or not well ventilated, but uh, heated, and not wear socks. My feet are cold. Ah, uh, yes. Just so you know. Uh, yes. Yay, more slots. Yes. You know. Okay, cool. Okay, two points. Board retention. Current health drained per second. Plus two intelligence with less health regen. Interesting. Ooh, poison and necrotic penetration. Ah, uh, well, that's a loaded question, but uh, it's getting up there. It's it's not done yet. You can't call uh, like the best ARPG out out there, and unless the game is done. Um, to me, anyways, you can't call it that until it's done. Uh, let's get into that. But it's damn good. It is damn good. <laughs> May I a smile upon you? And I help you. It's getting there. Every patch, it's just something great. Stay safe, traveler. Because I, I kind of still think Grim Dawn's kind of better. I don't know. That's a tough call too, though. That's a tough call. Grim Dawn's great. Okay, we are going over here. Back to what we were, were doing. Yeah. Yeah, the customization is is a beautiful thing in this game. And it, it, it's more... I think it's more understandable. It's it's It spells it out better for you. I think when things like uh, work with each other, like this one has Soul Feast, which works with a skill that's actually called Soul Feast. So if you upgrade Soul Feast, when you use Ore of Decay, it'll trigger Soul Feast. I did that on my dancing, my uh, dancing blade build. I was like throwing poison flasks out as I was using it or something like that. I can't remember exactly what it was, but yeah. Very yes. Popular. I see. Hey, you're welcome. Welcome anytime. Now, I am sorry, YouTube. Um, there's probably going to be a video short um, going on to YouTube. I missed time, baby. So I should be starting at 10.30, not 11.30. Necrotic resistance? Yeah, we're just going to leave you. I do have good poison damage, though. So I might have been able to fight him with poison. A lot of the times, uh, killing the big guys isn't as beneficial, unless you can really nuke them. Otherwise, the time it takes to kill them uh, does not equal out for EXP and amount of damage. Like maybe I can kill him if I like stack off poison. It's not horrendously long. It's okay. My mic is also really far away. That could have something to do with it. 
I'm leaning back so my kid can uh, rest on me. It's not peaking too high though on the music. I think it's just because my mic is far away from me. You could also do this to help a little bit. Turn that a little bit. Yeah, I was just too far away. And now my my camera uh, settings are all messed up because I'm so in a different position. That is one thing I'm still working out as a new streamer is all my settings for my camera. Can't quite get it right. Because I have a green screen, so that's what messes with everything. Maybe I'll try squeezing like an extra 15 minutes out. Feel my wrath. Uh, what is that one? Reflective? Oh, I got three kids, my man. <laughs> yeah, no, I have a two-year-old and I'm two three-month-old now. Yep, nope, I'm in full, full dad hell, or pit, whatever you want to call it. But yeah, we had twins uh, in October. It's, it's crazy. And we definitely did not know anything about it. <laughs> but, yeah. We'll get a little close, get some... Nice. Nope, I am 29. Apparently these guys want to go behind me, so we're going to go this way. Yeah, that's one thing about having kids a little bit younger. I don't even know if I was that young, but... We're gonna be pretty. We're we're not gonna be too old when they uh, graduate and stuff. So now it'll be nice. Like my aunt and my uncle, they had their kid. Um, they struggled to have it to begin with, but uh, they didn't have them until they were forty. They had one kid. I think they were forty something when they had their kid. Their uh, only kid. So, that's tough. Nice. Yeah, it's not a bad age. If, uh, if you can do it, it's, uh, it's not a bad age to have a kid. Because then you can do a lot more with them. So, looking forward to that. But definitely having kids is a when you're ready thing. That's what, yeah, that's what kids are. That's the, you know, the dream scenario anyways. Sometimes you don't have a choice. <laughs> I feel like I took the long way around. I love these areas with all these small mobs. I don't really... This is going great.
stay asleep. Stay asleep. Shh. Shh. <laughs> yeah, well, the funny thing is, though, too, like when you're a first parent, it's a struggle. Um, but now that we have, even though we had twins on our second set of kids, <laughs> not second set, uh, just when we had our twins, um, these two, uh, these two are going a lot smoother than our first one, I guess is a word you could use. We had some, uh, good amount of struggles with our first kid. Even though there's two of them, I think it's still technically going better. So it's, it's a weird scenario there. Oh, wrong button. I tried teleporting and I was pushing my wrong buttons again. Try this again. Maybe I need to kill these guys. They're, they're kind of piling up a lot. Yeah, they're piling up a lot. Dude, my, my, my poison damage is ridiculous though. I poison and necrotic dot damage. If it gets up there. Like, there's another one that died just from the dot damage. Right. 15 plus stacks is a lot of damage. I'm not sure if things de-aggro in this game, I'm not sure. Oh, I'm just kind of running in a direction. <laughs> Discovery? Is that a new one for me? It is. Oh, a rune of ascendance. Change the item into a unique or set item of the same item type. Oh. Using this on a silver ring could turn it into a unique ring, including one ones that are not silver rings however it cannot turn into a helmet huh that's awesome that that must be really rare then to get to get one of these to okay that's awesome okay cool that is one thing that is always annoying about farming is you have to, uh, hello, good morning, have a good morning, do you have a good nap? Uh, I'm gonna get off here soon, whoa, oh go pee, oh no, let's go.
Okay, guys, that's as good as time as any to uh, pause the stream and uh, see hey. you guys. Hey, everybody, I'm right here. What's up? I'm right here. Come here, come here. Yes, you do need new panties. She's in currently potty training. And uh, she did, we didn't make it there fast enough. I'm assuming she ran away from her mom before she went to the bathroom. <laughs> uh, I know, right? Yeah, I don't want to. Well, I'll wait on the drunk part. I'll take the, the helping them pee. Uh, but anyways, I'll see you guys later. <laughs> it was a blast. Uh, more Last Epoch next Saturday, every Saturday. Uh, new schedule is going to be 10.30. Yeah, 10.30 to uh, 2.30. Three hours and 45 minutes. That's what I go for. What do you need? Y you need a lot of things. <laughs> Anyways, I'll see you guys later. Uh, it was a blast. This build has been going really well. And we got something going on with this Aura of Decay ton of poison stacks. I should probably lean on that poison damage. Uh, but yeah. And we will try out the game um, Mad Hat uh, recommended. Uh, what was it again? I might still have it up. It was like Chronic something. I don't remember. What was the game you talked about? Mad Hat, what was the game you talked about? <laughs> uh, I'm watching somebody play through this game, by the way. Which this game is a looks uh, crazy fun to watch. I recommend watching uh, Retromation play it on YouTube. He's really fun to watch. Do, do, do. I will, I will. Anyways, okay. I'll see you guys later. Thank you uh, for stopping by and supporting me. I think we had three viewers like 90% of the day, which is what we're aiming for to get affiliate. Uh, just to show you guys a little bit here real quick before I jump off. I know, Amelia Babe. I know. I know. To get affiliate, you need an average of three, seven days, Ugh. which I can control stream seven different days. I can control that. And then everything else uh, we already got, so. But yeah, that's what we're working for. But anyways, I gotta go. See you guys later. <laughs> I got fussing babies. And it was a pleasure. <laughs>